Let's talk about vitamin B6, a simple nutrient that plays a massive role in your nervous system, mental health, and metabolism. We'll cover when to suspect a deficiency, which medications can deplete it, how to treat it safely, and warning signs of getting too much. Vitamin B6, also called pyridoxine, helps your body produce neurotransmitters like serotonin, dopamine, and GABA. It's also key for nerve health, red blood cell production, and homocysteine metabolism. You might have a B6 deficiency if you're experiencing numbness or tingling in your hands or feet, burning pain, especially in the legs. Depression or mood changes, fatigue or brain fog, or even seizures in rare cases may also indicate a deficiency. Deficiency is more likely in people with alcoholism, malabsorption or chronic illness, like diabetes, heart disease or asthma. Several common medications can lower B6 levels by interfering with its metabolism. Isoniazid, used for tuberculosis, hydrolyzine, for blood pressure, penicillamine, for rheumatoid arthritis, or Wilson's disease, levodopa with carbidopa, for Parkinson's disease. Even birth control pills can lower B6 over time. If you're on these meds and have symptoms, talk to your doctor. You can check your B6 level with a simple blood test called PLP, that's pyridoxal 5 phosphate A level below 20 NMOL stars L may mean deficiency. Below 10 NMOL cell symptoms are more likely. Most people do well with 25 to 50 milligrams per day of B6. That's enough to fix a deficiency without causing harm. More isn't always better. Taking too much B6, especially over 200 milligrams per day long term, can cause serious problems like burning pain, loss of balance, permanent nerve damage called sensory neuronopathy. Some cases have happened even with doses as low as 100 milligrams day if taken for months. Vitamin B6 is essential, especially for nerve health and brain function, but too little or too much can harm you. If you're on medications or have symptoms, ask your doctor to check your levels. And if you found this helpful, like subscribe or share with someone who might benefit.